thing where we're starting to see now is the realization that AI is gonna change everything we've done before. It's gonna change things in dramatic, positive ways. The only perhaps analogy I could find in the past was the internet. The internet changed everything we do. It changed how we study, how we communicate, the stories we tell each other. This is perhaps very similar or even, even bigger. I'm Cristobal Valenzuela. I'm the co-founder and the CEO of Runway. Runway is a research company that allows you to turn text, just language, into video. I'm Ameya Bhattavdekar, and I'm a machine learning scientist at Microsoft. Machine learning scientist is someone who trains algorithms using data so that we can introduce intelligence into products like Microsoft Office, Windows, Facebook, etc. And so now you can just say, create a presentation for me about American presidents. And this agent can just understand that and write that document for you, give you an initial draft so that you're not looking at a blank page. Hi, I'm Mira Murati. I'm the Chief Technology Officer at OpenAI, the company that created ChatGPT. It's very important to push your creativity by using these tools, tinkering with them, playing and building with them. Use them as amplifying tools so that you can be more creative. Hi, my name is Kajor Vassell and I am a software development engineer here at Amazon. On the software side of like Amazon Music, we use generative AI to help choose what customers will listen to. Based on this customer's past choices, what would they like now? Hi, I am Bakari. I am a senior technical product manager for AWS. In my personal life, I use Gen AI as a personal trip planner. When I'm traveling to a new city or country, I think it's like one of the best tools to use for itineraries. Hi, I'm Matt. I am a senior solutions architect at AWS. I use generative AI a lot to summarize notes from a meeting. You can take a picture of your analog notes and upload it, and it'll summarize it. I always remind people that these are tools. In the same way that our calculator was a tool, AI will become the same. It's like a computer. You, you are able to do things you were unable to do before, but it's still the humans who are at the center of the technology. You know, everybody's a little scared of it, right? A lot of people think Gen AI is going to replace people, and what we say is Gen AI is not going to replace people. People who understand Gen AI will replace people. I think AI has the potential to really improve almost every aspect of life and help us tackle really hard challenges in education, healthcare, climate.